Hi, so I'm going to show you how to add an ADA turning circle to your bathroom floor plans. You're going to need to have this per code to show that your bathroom is indeed accessible to someone in a wheelchair or a walker. Here it is shown here, um, the circle itself, the diameter, meaning the whole width of it is five feet. Um, the radius is shown here is two and a half feet. I'm just going to delete that so you can see how I put it in. Um, you also want to have this, um, the circle here on your floor plan. And um, probably if there's already one here because I did it earlier and also um, on your furniture plan. It's correct to have them on both of that. I'm going to show it to you here on level one. Now, if you did the duplicate with detailing option, once we put a circle here, it's going to show up on all the other plans. If you didn't, we're just going to copy and paste it. So I'll show you how to do that now. So you want to go up here under the annotate tab right here, pick detail line then this modify option opens up way over here under draw. We have a circle in the top far right there. So you click on that. And as you start to draw it, you can see, it's, you can't really see it too much because I have text here. You can see when it hits the two and a half feet, or you can also type in 2.5 feet and hit enter. And now that's the two, uh, two and a half foot radius that makes a five foot circle. Now right here, this is not correct the way it's shown. So I'm going to left click on with my mouse, left click on it. I'm going to use the down arrow on my keyboard just to kind of nudge it along. So if I kind of press pushing down, it's moving it around. I'm going to kind of move it around and over to here. And that's the correct designation to show that uh, when someone comes in, the door closes behind them, they're able to basically maneuver around to use the transfer to the toilet, transfer off, maneuver again to the bathroom. Because the idea is this circle, there should be no solid objects within this circle. And that allows the person enough clearance to, to move around in this room. Now, if we need to copy it on our other plans, I just kind of left clicked and selected it, control C. And then in my case, if it wasn't here, I'll just delete this guy out. I'll hit control V and there it is in this little blue box is coming up to show me I can kind of place it right back where I had it before which I'll kind of overlap and do that so that one's all set and like I said you should also have it on your furniture plan um if both of if you happen to have two bathrooms and both of them are accessible make sure to put the circle in both of them um if only one is accessible make sure to label that one ADA restroom the other should just be labeled restroom and then you would not show the circle inside of it all right hope that helps and that's, you know, an easy way just to add the circles in.